Hey, what's up? How's it going? Uh, gonna kind of do a test run here. Actually, kind of had a blast playing this fucking game right here. It was cool. It was badass. Uh, Dirg, or Dirge, of Cerberus, Final Fantasy VII, uh, developed and published by Squaresoft, um, and let's see, obviously part of the Final Fantasy VII series of stuff, released in North America on August 15, 2006. And, uh, is an action role playing third person shooter video game developed and published by Square Enix in 2006 for the PlayStation 2. It is part of the compilation of Final Fantasy VII Meta Series, a multimedia collection set within the universe of the popular 1997 video game Final Fantasy VII. The game is set three years after the original game's. And, and it focuses on one of the game's playable characters, Vincent Valentine. In the story, Vincent is targeted by a deep ground, a mysterious organization that plans to awaken the creature Omega, which is able to destroy the planet. At, as the first Final Fantasy shooter game, the game staff had various problems developing, and although producer Yoshinori Kitasi or Kitase, found it challenging and added role-playing video game elements in order to make it entertaining for new gamers of the genre. Uh, when Dirge of Cerberus, Cerberus started globalization, various of its aspects were modified in order to make it more appealing. The music of the game was composed uh, by Masashi Hama Hamazu. Well, its two main theme songs were composed by Japanese singer and actor Gact. A mobile phone tie-in was also released during 2006, while in 2008, Square republished it in Japan with updates made for the Western version, although the game has sold nearly 1 million copies overseas and 1.5 million worldwide as of 2011, it received mixed critical response by video game publications due to its design and issues with the gameplay. Um, I was trying to find where to turn off the audio stuff. I don't think I find it in here, so... Um, yeah, I don't. Uh, Dirge of Cerberus is a third-person shooter game with role-playing game elements. Battle to cure in real time with HUD displaying information, including Vincent's HP and MP, a currently selected item and quantity thereof, and a crosshair to aid targeting enemies. Action is viewed from an over-the-shoulder perspective similar to Resident Evil 4. Defeating enemies yields EXP at the end of each stage and can either be used to level up Vincent, increasing his statistics, or converted to guilt. which can be used to purchase items and equipment upgrades at jukebox shaped shops scattered throughout each stage or this shop at the end of a stage which also allows the purchase of additional equipment. Unlike Final Fantasy 7 where a character could equip three types of equipment weapon armor and accessory Vincent's equipment consists solely of his weapon which has algamate uh Amalgamated. Amalgamated. The effects of armor and extra accessories for customization. Players can customize three weapons through the frame a three barrel handgun, he names Cerberus, uh, as well as a rifle, Hydra, and a machine gun, Griffin, which are two new weapon types in the size of a Barrel, short, regular, long barrel with longer barrels affording targets of enemies that are further away at the cost of weight. Accessories include a sniper scope, charms such as the Cerberus charm, which can increase Vincent's defense and depress the weight of the gun, which is, affects the speed of Vincent's actions. Okay, 
Okay. Let's get out of here. Just remember to keep on guard until you're clear of the red zone. Check the Mako cannon. But we already. What? What the? Just as I thought. Hold on. Hold on. This is crazy. There's no way anybody could be up there. No. Yuffie, rendezvous with Cloud and the others. It looks like I still have some work to do. Hey, whoa! Vincent, get out of Yuffie. Here. For the longest, I'd be like, oh, it's Yuffie, not Yuffie. Oh, my. Something is not right here. What could it be? I don't think he I don't think he even got full trigger though. So something mysteriously went wrong, obviously. And he's like all bewildered, like what the hell happened? And now Shit's all blowing up around him. I don't think his little pea shooter was that strong. No. No. Well, there was an intro, I think. There may be more. I think that's all of it, though. Oh, yeah. Three years later, some such shit happens. Um, he and Yuffie have, like, a family or something. And she poops them all out of her butt. I don't know. More intro stuff, I guess. They always try to do some badass intros in their games, though. And I mean, that's cool. That's awesome. Yeah. I don't know. Come on. Get you all hyped up for a good game. So. We meet again. Lucrezia. Oh, no touching. Anything else? I'm so sorry. No more. I am oh, it's just there. You should apologize. Oh, it was just dialogue. Is there more dialogue? However, the group's whereabouts still remain unknown. What really happened down there? Tonight, for the first time, we bring you the final transmission to the end before all contact was lost. For the past three years, this door has remained sealed. However, that seal is about to be broken. There are no records of this place located deep beneath the Jima Dome. Another of the company's secrets revealed recently. According to investigative reports, there is evidence that thousands of people were once transferred. Oh, and all celebration, let's all get drunk and tap a feel on the closest person next to us. You already saw that all in action first hand. Somebody's gonna get pickpocketed. Uh, of course, all of them are lifting up their dress tonight. You can see fancy footwork, yeah, that's gonna woo the drunk guys. Check that out. Yeah, unfortunately, pretty much, for the most part, entirety of this video. 
it's all pretty much the intro. So this gets you all hyped up for what's to come uh, in future videos, I guess. There's a couple more videos before I call the quits on the test run, but I figured it was enough so I could get a gist of the game, and it was cool. It was fun. Unfortunately, I didn't get to finish everything that was on Wikipedia because everybody starts getting shot, and like somebody had to run or something, like little sissy. And it's like for some reason people can't run indoors, I guess. And oh, it's like, hey, we see Vincent, and we're gonna blow your shit up, son. And of course. That's how it goes down. Somehow his bullets are that powerful and his gun is that powerful enough to blow up uh, ships and stuff, I guess. So, yeah, that's like pretty much that, I guess. Uh, we'll come to a conclusion here in a moment when all this fa fancy shit is over with. And, uh, yeah, cool. Thanks for watching. Tune in for the next couple parts, whatever that is. And I shall see you and all that good stuff. Until next time, peace.